gamification that you just got from PhytoTrack. I thought it was really, really exciting, and it just addresses a lot of issues in the industry. Wow, we, we are so excited about the PhytoTrack acquisition and about adding gamification to our product suite. Um, gamification has been in call centers since the beginning of call centers. Um, everybody's been doing it manually and on an ad hoc basis, um, doing a little bit of it here and there. Some people do it better than others. Some people do it extreme and every day and all day. And some people, you know, do it just occasionally for a little boost. But um, when I saw the full uh, breadth of the PhytoTrack product, um, I knew as soon as I saw that entire product suite that we had to buy that company and we had to add it as noble gamification to our product suite. It's, um, it's completely different than anything I've ever seen from a gamification standpoint. It's not just a little spinning wheel or a little contest here and there. It's a complete ecosystem that's been made completely social, perfect for millennials, and dramatic reductions in turnover and huge increases in agent engagement and productivity metrics that are silly easy to measure right from within the system. That, and fun. And fun. <laughs> uh, and then that's, that's the other part of it. It was like, my goodness, this stuff is just fun. Um, I said to myself, I said, every one of my customers is going to love that stuff when they see it. We think it's going to be a game changer in call centers. I'm sure there will be people that will follow us into that to a degree. And there's a few other smaller companies out there that have gamification. And some of them have different bits and pieces of what we now have with noble gamification. But I've, uh, I've done a reasonable amount of research and not seen anything that has the breadth that we have. So what did you think of the gamification when you saw it, Nancy? Well, I love it. One of the things I thought was just intuitive. And then the way that they did the games, you know, they had the Field 64, and I'm like all over this, thinking this is really exciting. But one of the things that, um, two things, one is that it really speaks to the millennial workforce and not just the agents. I've never seen anything where you can, you know, incent multiple layers because the supervisors, they came up from the agent ranks. Right. So I thought that was really a really pretty sweet thing to be able to have everybody in the game, so to speak. You know, engaging the supervisors is huge um, because theoretically they're the people you're counting on to improve agent performance on a day-to-day -day basis and coach those agents. So having the built-in coaching platform and have that gamified and have them incentivized to do it and competing and then having the executive level dashboard where the executives that theoretically approve the money for this gamification, <laughs> be able to see the metrics yeah. and watch them improve uh, in real time. That, that is just huge. So another component of this you just mentioned was the integrated learning. And that also speaks well to the workforce we have now because it's consumable in pieces when you need it. And I think that therefore much more effective. Yeah, and, and what it does is by gamifying the learning management system, you're able to, to have your agents compete to see yeah. who can learn this content the quickest, the best. You can reward highest scores if you want to. You can reward highest first attempt score even so that you don't have agents just trying to get through it um, in order to get some points to have it completed. And um, it's, it's definitely uh, the most full suite that I've ever seen out there. And every bit of it is social. The fact that agents can challenge other agents to duels, uh, agents can um, give high fives, you know, almost like a Facebook like right. to other agents yeah. based on that, that other agent um, achieving a certain level or, or getting an award. The leaderboard is, uh, is, is, is really completely integrated into it and it's completely fed automatically uh, from everything else that you do. You don't have to then go and set up a leaderboard. It's, uh, it, it's, it's a beautiful thing. The dozens of customers that we do have using it Every one of them has been just blown away with the productivity increases and the agent engagement and the reduction in turnover. So the reduction in turnover, that's, by the way, I was going to say, I want to be an agent when I saw this demo. <laughs> but the reduction in turnover um, is huge. I mean, the cost to hire and so you know, employee engagement is really key. So I'm going to move to another area. Sure. When I was um, looking at shift track yeah. and the ability to be able to, you know, 
bring in the agent and allow them to do things on a mobile device or be able to you know, participate in their own scheduling, that is huge because, as we know, um, the millennials and younger, they'd rather have less pay for more flexibility. Yes. And it's not even them now. I think that's just all the way People through in the industry. General. Yeah, no, that's exactly right. It's a huge motivator. So when, when for a while now, we've had the ability to, uh, with our product, uh, to have what we call smart adherence. Yeah. Because with any workforce management product, um, you can create the most amazing schedule uh, using all this fancy math and algorithms and what have you. Awesome. But if your agents don't adhere to the schedule, you don't get any of the benefit from yeah. that. So we've for a long time had the ability to force the agents off of the, of the work while, uh, when they're supposed to take their break or their lunch after they finish their call. So um, we can uh, have the adherence uh, you know, more, uh, we can improve adherence that way, but we've never had the ability to get them back to work. Yeah. And so I used to joke that what we needed was the hook. You know, we needed that big yeah. hook, like they pulled people off stage in the That's old right. days. We, we needed need the hook. hook. We needed the hook to go pull them back from their break. It's time to be back now from your break or from lunch. And um, with the mobile app, we kind of have that now yeah. because uh, we, we know can, they're wedded we, to their devices, right? That's right. And, and we can send push notifications yeah. now that uh, they have the app on their phone, so we can remind them, "Hey, you're supposed to be back in five minutes." Uh, you can uh, set up whatever type of a countdown that you want to remind them, and we think that's going to be uh, just as, uh, as useful in improving adherence as being able to make them take their breaks on time. Thanks, Jim. We're out of time now, but it was great talking to you and finding out what Noble's doing now and what they're going to be doing in the future, and I look forward to talking to you about it again. It's been great talking to you. Thanks.